Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Iron United for another transfer special. Uh, the links to Yassine Brahimi don't seem to be wanting to stop today. Um, the 29 year old has once again been linked with a move to West Ham. Apparently we are in talks to sign him on a potential free transfer uh, after he's failed to agree terms with Porto. They're still yet to negotiate a new deal for him as his contract is running out. Um, he's an Algerian international, uh, over 30 caps for them at international level he played for. France under 21s growing up, 13 goals and 4 assists for Porto last season, obviously 29 years of age so he's got experience especially playing in the likes of the Champions League competitions, uh, he's a versatile um, attacking player, can play out wide on the wing and I think we'll, we'll bring a lot of flair to our side if we could get him, apparently he's also looking for a decent financial package and uh, I believe West Ham being in, in and around the top 30 richest clubs in the world we'd definitely be able to throw some funds at him especially if we get him on a free um, after the news that the likes of Andy Carroll have left, Adrian's going to be leaving. It definitely frees up some some fees and wages, and maybe that can go towards getting Brahimi in. Uh, he can play in behind the striker. He can play out wide, as I've mentioned. He's a very tricky player. Loves to drop the shoulder. Um, pops in, pops up with the odd goal every now and then, and the assist. And um, will definitely be someone that can help shift the burden that we place on the likes of Felipe Anderson, Yarmolenko, and Mikel Antonio. So yeah, for me, it's a, he's a player that I've been looking at for quite some time. I've seen him play in the Champions League for Porto and he's he's done a great job. Uh, obviously, he's surplus to requirements if they're not going to give him a new deal. But I definitely think on a free for us, it could be a massive signing. So yeah, fingers crossed we could get it over the line and get him in the door. Come on, you irons. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it is true. The leaked photos are going to be our kids for next season. Um, overall, I'm absolutely delighted with both of them. Um, especially the away, the away strip. I think it's a classic, classic kit. Uh, love the all-white. Love that it takes into account our history. And there's that really nice, intricate detail on both of them. The crossed hammers on the back of the neck that I really, really think is, is a nice touch. Um, the home kit is, is very different to what we've seen in a long time. Uh, you've obviously got the, the light blue coming across. We've got the light blue sleeves. That's that's made a return from last season. And I think yeah, it would be nice to... To have claret socks for a change, just just something different. And I must say, when I first saw the leaked images, I wasn't too impressed. But actually seeing it on the players is, is very, very different. I love it. So yeah, definitely going to be getting the away kit for next season, 100%. As soon as that becomes available, yeah, definitely going to get on that. Classic, 